open an image to work with. An image with high contrast works the best. Use the quick selection tool to select the pixels around the cup. Change the size of the brush to 1 in order to select the area near the handle. I could have selected the cup rather than the beans surrounding the cup. Because I have to remove the brown in the cup handle, it's easier to select the beans than select the inverse pixels to make the selection. Click the Refine Edge button. Click Smart Radius, set it to 1, set Smooth to 1 or 2, Contrast to 40, shift the edge to negative 5. In the Output section, click on Decontaminate Colors, leave it set at 50%. Selecting this option means we have to do something with the output. Click on the Output to combo box. Several choices are here. New layer. New layer with layer mask. New document. And new document with a layer mask. All are good options, and which one you pick depends on your project needs. This time we're going to select New layer with a layer mask. Click OK to mask the background. Finally, I'm going to crop this image a bit to eliminate extra empty space. Now I can export the image as a PNG image, which supports transparency. If I were to export the image as a JPEG image, the background would be white.